Hey guys, yeah, so before I start up this video for you guys, I just wanted to tell you guys that my uncle does have a adult male available. And this is a blue phone boy, actually with Roach X J Load. So Roach man, I miss that dude, man. And uh, he definitely did play his role when it comes with uh stamping his headpiece uh in, in terms of these puppies and looks amazing. So uh, ready to go all akc we only do akc and that's that's pretty much it the only type of organization that we do i love akc just because they do genetic testing and stuff like that so legit uh dog organization i love akc um but yeah that's that's pretty much it and also like uh he also he's selling this boy now because he he wants he likes odin a lot better now um i can say that shucks is kind of the same um they just look different um this one looks more this boy, the blue fawn, he looks more like Roach, you know, look more uh, like wild, you know, big, more wrinkled. And Odin looks a little bit more clean, but I don't know, I like that more wrinkled look appearance uh, for me. Uh, that's my taste, like Vegeta, for example, Vegeta and Roach look the same. And uh, I just like that look a lot better. So he finally went with Odin instead. So yeah, um, I think that's pretty much it. And uh, yeah, so you guys like more of that classic kind of style. I mean, I, it's considered classic to me now. Uh, it could be structure for you guys, um, but yeah, he's not as crazy like Vegeta, um, and uh, you know he's still thinking it out. So he's only like a year old. So that's pretty much it, you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy the content, and let's actually get right on with it. Oh yeah, and uh, just just text me, just text me if you guys are interested. Though, so. love you guys so much. Let's go. Hey guys, so yeah, in today's video, I just really wanted to talk to you guys pretty much about the uh, the types of styles, like finding a type of style for you guys, just because like with me within my yard, I have a lot of styles, you know, like Cardi B, for example, a lot short, a lot of more muscular and compact rear, and just starting to get skinny now because it's summertime, uh, as I said in my last video uh, this morning, actually. So I'm starting to actually let them get skinny now just because uh, I, don't, I don't want them to have uh, more proneness, if that's even a word, a, a, a more of a risk of getting, you know, dehydrated. So today guys, I just really wanted to talk to you guys about is finding your own style of a type of bully, a type of dog, type of Frenchie, uh, it could be anything, just for you, you know, just because a lot of you guys would actually text me, you know, like text me saying, hey man, I feel like I should jump on your blood or I should jump on the XBs or the DK, the true D direct DK or uh, Grand Trisus and blah, 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 all that shit. And I just feel like if they, if I don't get onto that, everybody's going to look at me as a type of joke. And with my response to that, you guys, I'm just going to say there's always going to be a market for you guys, you know, for, for anybody. Because the thing is, I'm going to tell you guys the truth. Not every one of you guys, not everybody, even my subscribers, even you, me, even you guys that love me, don't like my dogs. And I want to tell you guys that. Just because that's just the damn truth. Not everybody likes my dogs. Not everybody likes, you know, like, like them having short and muscular and compact and stuff like that, you know? It's just the way it is. We all have different styles and that's what I wanted to talk about with you guys today. Just because everybody's got their own damn style. And, you know, th this, is, this is what makes me want to talk about competition as well. Um, you guys are even talking about, like, dude, uh, you should go out and do shows and, you know, do have competition and stuff like that. And honestly, like... Honestly, you guys, you know, I, the competition with other people, I honestly don't really care. Like, it's fun. Yeah, it's fun and all. But mainly the, the main port, the main vision of me is competition to myself. You know, let me explain to you guys, right? Let me explain to you guys. The reason why, you know, I don't really care about the dub or really care about the trophies and stuff like that is because, like, the thing is, and I, and I, I finally realized, you know, not everybody's going to like your style, if you're not everybody. And, um, you know, I like this say, say example like this. Some people were even text me like, dude, you should get on with the XBs or, oh, dude, you should mix it up with that blood and stuff like that. You should mix it up with the DK, like, like with the XBs, Grinch Sues and stuff like that. And honestly, you guys, I'm just going to say like, yeah, I love, I love those styles. I'm not going to, I'm not, I'm not going to be wrong. You know, I, I, I like those styles. I'm not going to lie. 
um but the thing is i don't like it 100 percent like how i like my dogs right and it goes the same with them they're not gonna like my dogs 100 percent but they can at least respect my style and that's what it's all about you know loving your own style believing your own blood which is why i always talk about this when i say believe in your blood because the thing is when you believe in your blood and you love your dogs you know that's when people will really believe with you if you don't believe in your dogs people ain't gonna believe with you either that's why you know you gotta hype up your dog you gotta hype up your dogs that you love them and you got to think the, the world to them. You got to think that they're the best into your eyes, into your vision, and people will follow you, right? That people will follow you. You know, stop bitching, stop complaining. Like, man, that dog is ugly. How are they getting sales and stuff like that? And, hey, man, you just suck. You just suck. And I'm just going to be honest with you guys. You know, you just suck, right? Just like me. You know, I used to be like that. I'm like, damn, that dog, man, he, I think my dog looks better, but it is what it is, you know, it is what it is, you know, I used to be like that, but now it's changed, it's a whole different mindset for me, and I'm gonna be honest with you guys, you know, I used to be like that now, but before, but now it's, it's changed now, and I just wanted to say, you know, like, there is a reason why top breeders within those bloods don't mix each other's bloods together, there's a reason why, you know, there is a reason why we don't mix bloods with each other because the thing is we want to keep that specific look. You know, Grinch wants to keep that specific look. The Seuss want to keep that. You know, I think they kind of look the same, honestly. But uh, XB's look this, has that specific look, and um, that's all I'm gonna say. You know, that's all I'm gonna say. And it, it, it feels kind of weird to mix it up with the DK or mix it with my blood. It feels kind of weird. You know, I t as I said, th there's a reason why they don't mix those bloods together because the thing is, we, we don't know what to expect. You know, we really don't know what to expect. Like, say for example, like with me, I love XBs in them, but I feel like their head's too small. That's just the way it is for me. Um, the really beautiful headpiece, but I just love a bigger bobblehead of a type of headpiece uh, for my dogs, right? And uh, I feel like their heads are too small. Um, I feel like the forearms are too small. I don't, I'm not a fan of the forearms. I'm just gonna point that out because if you compare my forearms with theirs, uh, my forearms are a lot bigger, but what I can say about theirs is that their backs, their their back muscles are a lot better than mine. You know what I'm saying? So you have to find a style with what you like, right? I know the the strengths and weaknesses within each blood when I go look at them. But the thing is, are those even strength and are are those even strengths and weaknesses to them? Are those even strengths and weaknesses to me? right everything is subjective what, what you think is strength like what you think is strong what you think is weak right so that's what i wanted to talk about today because the thing is guys they're not gonna look at you at, like a joke and, and if they do man they're fucking clowns bro they're fucking clowns and the thing is man hopefully most breeders right most breeders you know that are humble they will respect you for the type of style you like and that's why we always say, you know, we, we stay in our own lane. We like our own style. And we know everybody's not going to like my style. We know everybody's not going to like their style or your style, right? So that's what I wanted to, to talk about today, right? Well, I, I'm thirsty. So that's pretty much it um, that I wanted to talk to you. So you guys don't think that you have to jump on my 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 blood because it's, it's, it's getting hyped, right? That blood is already hyped already because of my uncles in them. Um, but... I just wanted to say, man, you know, as of right now, my uncles in the East Coast, we're creating an old time of bloodline right here, you know, with Cardi and them and with Suki and Cypher. So I honestly don't even think they look like the real, you know, direct primitive blood in Wisconsin anymore. You know, I feel like they look like their own style. Um, it's already been washed out, honestly, now it's, it's washed out. But other than that, you know, I, I like it my way. And to tell you guys the truth, I don't really like it directly. Uh, I don't like it 100% as well with, with my uncle's blood in, in the West Coast. My uncle's in the West Coast. I don't like them 100% like that, you know? Um, it's just the damn truth, you know? And maybe they might not like my style 100%, you know? But they like theirs. As long as that they love theirs and I love mine, I love, my, I love myself, I love my own dogs, that's the stuff that matters most. And that's just real talk, man. That's just real talk. You know, I, I, just, I just wanted to throw it out there, you know, just because I know deep inside me, I know deep inside them, they love their dogs more. They're like their style of dogs more than my style, even though it's kind of the same blood, right? But there's always levels. There's always like different spins to it, right? Right? So like Grinch, for example, or Seuss, 
there is different qualities of Seuss and there's different qualities of DK blood. You know, that's just the damn truth, right? So that's pretty much it, you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy the content and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. And uh, yeah, love you guys. Peace.